what is up youtube so today i want to talk a little bit about my thoughts about this thing that samsung's next smartphone which should be the galaxy s 22 may feature an amd gpu uh, this is a story that gsm arena wrote about and uh, I want to talk a little bit about it because I currently have, I have the Galaxy S10 Plus, I have the uh, Samsung Galaxy, I have the Galaxy S10 Plus, and I have the Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra. And personally, this is kind of interesting. So AMD, we know obviously that they're producing uh, amazing GPUs. And we know that Samsung is uh, struggling a little bit uh something is struggling a little bit with how they're doing things right now so the way something are doing things right now is in kind of in europe uh they have one variant of their latest samsung flagship device that usually get the exynos processor so you got the exynos 900 uh, processor in uh, the galaxy s10 plus and you have um or actually Exynos 900 was, yeah, it was in the S20 Ultra and the Exynos 2100 was in the new S, uh, S21. But the problem here is that, so Samsung is releasing one smartphone every year with their Exynos processor and then one with the Snapdragon processor from Qualcomm. And the Exynos processor has always been slower, I think around maybe like 20% slower than the Exynos variant. This means if you're buying the same smartphone, but in a region, let's say in Europe, you're getting actually a slower smartphone than maybe what you would get in North America that would get the Snapdragon variant of the same smartphone. So now it seems like Samsung is going to upgrade some things and do a system on a chip uh, with AMD that may actually improve things for the better in the Samsung Galaxy S22. We also know that Samsung is doing, um, I think they say goodbye to the Note series. It seems like we're not gonna get those phones anymore, but we know that Samsung are, are doing these uh, flip phones uh, like the Galaxy C Fold. So maybe the new variant of that is going to get this new AMD GPU. Uh, but we just got the Galaxy S21. So the Galaxy S22 may be uh, a year from now. So that is, uh, that's a little bit boring uh, that it's going to take that kind of long time before we would see this. Now, personally, I've been gaming on the Galaxy S20 Ultra um, and uh, it's not like the GPU or anything is, is struggling. Like for example, I've been playing um, uh, League of Legends Mobile Wild Rift and the graphics are basically amazing, uh, amazing performance, stable, 60 frames per second. But um, with these new AMD GPUs, we may see I, what I really would like is to see this whole industry start moving towards real mobile games coming out to smartphones that doesn't have these um, these pay to win features or annoying in-app purchases. So we've been having 10 years of mobile gaming that a lot of it has been like horrible experience. Uh, hopefully we can start to see more and more amazing games like League of, Legends, League of Legends Mobile Wild Rift that came out a couple of months ago. These games are, they don't have any like pay to win. Uh, they don't have annoying in-app purchases. And with better GPUs in smartphones and with better system on a chip, eventually we can see mobile game manufacturers really start to focus more and more on the mobile industry and create real games that doesn't have these annoying, horrible user experiences of in-app purchases and stuff like that. People basically want to own their game, like have used like one fee and do like one amazing game. Uh, I really hope we can start to see more of that. So 
hopefully these um, these new AMD GPUs can eventually bring us out like maybe GTA 5 mobile or something like that we see in Rockstar they usually release their um, their games eventually on mobile like 10 years later and we're kind of getting close so GTA 5 launched in 2013 it's soon uh, 2022 so maybe eventually we are gonna have as powerful gpus in smartphones that we we eventually can power like real really good games in in, in smartphones because it seems like cloud gaming kind of didn't work it seems like it never will work right now because internet speeds would have to be so amazing so we're gonna have a couple of more years where the gpu instead of smartphones are going to become more and more important for eventually these games that eventually will come out for smartphones in the future that obviously want an even better gpu than what currently exists inside of smartphones yeah so i'm kind of a little bit excited about this it's going to be interesting to see um what samsung is going to do are they going to change the design on the galaxy s22 as well they may actually do that because if you see the design um so when Samsung went from um, uh, S20 Ultra to S21, they just made a slight upgrade to the S20 Ultra design and just like made it a little bit sharper. But we may see a total redesign uh, with the S22. That's, that would be really, really exciting. Yeah, have a great day.